Hi friends, Miss Amanda here from Cardiff Busy Bee Preschool. Last week I read Soup Potato and this week I'm going to read Soup Potato Veggies Assemble. It is by Sue Hendra and Paul Lynette. And it is published by Simon & Schuster. Here we go. Let me see. Here are the vegetables. Looks like they're fast asleep. It was night time in the supermarket and everyone was sleeping peacefully. Or were they? Oh, who's not sleeping? Let's have a look. I can see something here. Oh, no, it's that pea again. What's P doing? Let's find out. Someone was looking for trouble. Oh, soon this supermarket will be mine. Oh, mine. And with one click, all the freezers were switched off. What does that mean? All the vegetables that are frozen will thaw out. And then what's going to happen? Mm. You may already know this, but some vegetables are frozen for a very good reason. If they defrost, they turn bad, really bad. And the baddest of them all is the evil pea. Wakey, wakey, he called. Oh, there he is. He's calling all his pea friends. Uh-oh, he's getting an army together. <gasps> oh, one evil pea is bad enough, but now there were bags of them. Oh, they're everywhere, look. Terrorising the vegetables. Oh, the supermarket was in meltdown. Run for it, panic Pepper. Now, Pepper... That's pepper. Now, pepper is actually a capsicum. Okay, In the UK or in Britain, it's called a pepper, but we call it a capsicum. And there's a red capsicum. And we've got, oh, we've got broccoli. Uh, I think that might be an orange. We've got cucumber, capsicum, pear, and carrot. And they're all very scared. S -s Save me, stuttered Pear. Oh, no. He's hiding at the top of the tins and all the peas are coming to get him. Oh, no. Save me, begged Melon. What's happening with Melon? Oh, Melon has been blindfolded and put on a spoon and the pea is ready to throw the jar on top of the end of the spoon so it hits the spoon and flips melon into the air oh no save me cried carrot oh poor carrot has been put in the toilet paper roll and now he's being rolled across the floor that's not very nice is it no I'm melting, pleaded Lolly, and time's running out. Oh, no. So they've turned off the freezer and now the ice lolly, or ice block as we call them, is melting. Was there anyone who could save them? Who do you think's going to help? Let's see. Dun, 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 soup potato to the rescue. Whoosh. He's ready to go. Before, but before Super Potato could save anyone, he was attacked by a swarm of peas. Ah! Oh no! What's going on? asked Aubergine. We're doomed, that's what, cried Cuc Cucumber. Things were going from bad to worse. So that is what they call an Aubergine, but we call it eggplants. A bit hard to see. There's cucumber, eggplant, 
Capsicum. Oh, poor Capsicum's fallen over and it's crying. Oh, sweet potatoes covered in peas. What's going to happen? Sue Potato was thrown onto the conveyor belt and he was heading straight for the bagging area. Was this the end for Sue Potato? Look, he's going across, across the conveyor belt and he's going to fall into the shopping bags. I'm going to need some backup if I can just call the V. Oh, he's using his belt and he's getting. Oh, super veggies to the rescue. Oh, look, he's got pumpkin, tomato. That looks like a cucumber, I think. And a corn. Could be a cucumber or a zucchini. We'll find out. There they are. Dun, dun, dun. So Sue Potato has got a team of vegetable superheroes. That's great. What can they do? They use ninja know-how. Hi! Oh, there's carrot. Oh, uh, sorry corn and he's kicked the peas into the dip I think it is they used massive muscles oh. and he's picked up the jar and saved melon they used fancy footwork oh look pumpkin saved the carrot and they used a box with a door cut in it. Oh, look. Tomatoes put a box with a door cut in it and they're all going in. And they're being caught. But what about the lollies? And where was Sue Potato? Let's see. Here he comes. Sorry I'm late, I just needed to pick up some dessert. Ah, oh, he's saving the ice lolly, ice block. Freezers on and he's putting it on. And now for those freezers, click. And I'll be needing a glass and a piece of paper. Huh? What's he going to do next? Let's see. Who ordered the vegetables? Screeched the evil pea. You think you've beaten me, but I'm going to. What's pea going to do? Oh, hoof. You're going to do what? Asked Sue Potato. Look, he's been caught with a glass and a piece of paper. Three cheers for Sue Potato, shouted Broccoli. Sue Potato blushed. I couldn't have done it without the super veggies. Actually, I'm not a vegetable. I'm a fruit, said Tomato. And everybody laughed and cheered. There they are, laughing and cheering. So Tomato is a fruit, not a vegetable. I thought that. There they are. That was a happy ending. No, it's still going. So with the peas back in their bags and the freezers locked, so it's locked, the peas are in their bags, the supermarket was once again a safe place to be. Isn't it wonderful, said one lolly to the other. We're all back to normal again. Oh, no, are they back to normal? They throw, they throw. They were frozen and then they started to melt and then they've frozen again. So now they're all mixed up. But hopefully they still taste good. The end. And now we've got all our sweet potatoes. Do we count them again? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 sweet potatoes. I love potatoes. My family call me the potato monster because I love potatoes. Mm. Anyway, I hope you have a nice and healthy dinner with fresh vegetables and maybe some fruit for dessert and maybe a little bit of ice cream or something cheeky. Even though that's uh, sometimes food, but it's still good to have sometimes as long as you eat all your veggies, okay? This is Miss Amanda signing off. Bye.